shot and killed while running from police. New developments tonight and a story CBS2 broke less than 24 hours ago. Good evening, everyone. I'm Pat Harvey. Within hours of our story airing, the police department released new photos to support its version of events, and a high-profile attorney took up the fight for the family of the man who was killed. CBS2's Jeff Nguyen is live in San Bernardino now with the very latest developments in this case. Jeff. Pat, the police department here says that it is in the process of investigating this shooting, and it also says that the security video that's been circulating online doesn't tell the full story. Alexis Hernandez contributed to a growing memorial for Robert Adams. The 23-year-old died after being shot by police Saturday. A security camera shows Adams in a parking lot. Then an unmarked San Bernardino police car pulls up. Two police officers in uniform get out and at least one of them starts shooting. Adams immediately ran away. We've paused the video before he was shot and killed. I watched the video. That was just... I don't understand, like, he's running away. Adam's family says he was working as a security guard. They spoke to our Nicole Comstock Monday night. He was not a threat to them. He was running for his life. Attorneys Ben Crump and Bradley Gage are representing the Adams family. In a joint statement, they said Robert appeared to be simply walking around the parking lot when officers exited their unmarked vehicle, firing their weapons at him immediately. Robert never even had a chance to explain himself. That was murder, period. Monday night, the San Bernardino Police Department released a statement in which it says the officers were investigating an illegal online gambling business when it says Adams pulled a gun from his waistband and began walking towards the officer's car. The department provided an enhanced photo of the gun in his hand and a picture of the weapon that was recovered. Hernandez says she was dealing with gambling problems, drug addiction, and homelessness. There were times Adams would find her wandering the streets. You pick me up and I'm taking you somewhere where you don't need to be out here doing that. You're way better than that. And the police department says that it is planning to release officer body cam video as well as a, a clearer version of the security footage. In addition, the chief will also provide statements about the use of force. We are live in San Bernardino. Jeff Nguyen, CBS2 News. Thank you, Jeff.